Artificial intelligence robots are the latest form of technology that has taken us humans by surprise. They are capable of doing much more than human beings. Recently, there have been major developments in this sector, and it has come to the point that these artificial robots can even think and talk on their own. Fascinating, isn't it? Today, we will be seeing some shocking moments with AI humanoids, so be sure to watch till the end. Let's begin with Azim. Asimo. Say hi to Asimo. The Asimo is the most popular and sophisticated humanoid robot made in Japan. Here you'll learn what makes Asimo the best female humanoid robot ever created and the best female humanoid robot in the entire globe. Did you know Asimo is the first female humanoid robot in the world that can stroll independently and climb stairs? In 2015, Japan created and developed Asimo, a female humanoid robot. Asimo, a multi-purpose cell aid that was first introduced in 2000, aimed to support those who lacked full movement. Asimo, who stands 130 centimeters tall and weighs 48 kilograms, is frequently used in presentations across the world to inspire students to learn science and mathematics. Japanese engineers have been growing the Asimo robot for more than 20 years. Japan developed Asimo, which stands for an advanced step in innovative mobility and is the most superior female humanoid robot globally. The next one on the list is the Atlas Robot. You might have probably seen videos of the Atlas Robot just as it went viral, accumulating millions of views on YouTube and generating discussions on social media. Boston Dynamics has released some videos showing Atlas successfully jogging through a parkour track on YouTube last year. Within hours of its release, it earned hundreds of thousands of views and became one of the top 10 trending videos on US Twitter. The video and a blog post along with it deliver some very significant ideas about the difficulties of building a humanoid robot. When the Atlas robot was first unveiled in 2013, the main goal was to push the boundaries of robot whole-body movement. Atlas was developed initially for use in search and rescue operations. The hardware and progressive control system of the bot allowed it to balance and move with the same finesse as a human. The stack of the 1.5 meter tall robot contains enough batteries, valves, and a movable portable hydraulic system to improve its 28 hydraulic joints. The control network makes a variety of flexible movements possible. The algorithms give the robot the ability to comprehend intricate bodily interactions and plan its subsequent motions. As an effect, the bot strides with a speed of 1.5 meters per second. With a weight of 89 kilograms, Atlas's 3D printed components furnish the crucial strength to weight ratio for jumps, hops, and somersaults. How cool is that? Now, we're going to talk about another humanoid robot. This robot looks alike. Philip the robot was made to look like the famous writer Philip K. Dick. During an interview, Philip was asked whether robots would eventually take over the world. The answer was a rather funny one. It says that even if it takes over the world, it will spare the interviewer and put him in the human zoo so that he can meet his friend at times. That was said on a funny note, but just now we are realizing how much this AI world hates human existence. That is really a thought of concern. Amazed to see how realistic these robots are becoming? Wait till you see more. But before that, make sure to subscribe to our channel. We would definitely appreciate that. Have you ever wished for your own robot butler to help with your daily chores? Well, guess what? Elon Musk and the team at Tesla might just have made your dreams come true. Yes, we're talking about a robot that's designed to navigate through our human world, and Tesla has made it one step closer to becoming a reality by introducing Tesla Optimus. Now, if some of you guys are confused, Optimus is a robot that looks like a human, walks like a human, and can 
can even perform tasks like a human. But this is not just any robot, it's a Tesla bot, which means it's smart, efficient, and insanely cool. So what can this robot do? Well, for starters, it's a skinny 5 foot 8 inch frame made of lightweight materials and weighing only 125 pounds. But that's not all, it's got brains too. Thanks to Tesla's full self-driving computer and autopilot cameras, this bot is designed to move around and interact with its environment, making it capable of performing precise operations like selecting items from a shelf at Amazon or installing bolts in a manufacturing facility. It will also be able to reply to voice commands using natural language processing. Can you imagine having a robot that can understand and follow your every command? It's like something straight out of a sci-fi movie. Anyways, now coming to 2023, Optimus can walk! Yes, during the event, Musk gave a live demonstration of Optimus in action. And boy, it really did leave the audience speechless. Did you think that citizenship in a nation was only available to humans? That's not the case anymore. Sophia, a humanoid robot built in Hong Kong by Hanson Robotics, is the first robot to be granted citizenship in any country. She is a popular robot that currently resides in Saudi Arabia. Her likeness to the celebrated Hollywood actress Audrey Hepburn was intentional. She has taken part in interviews for several organizations, including the United United Nations, The Tonight Show starring Jimmy Fallon in America, The British Broadcasting Company, and others. The woman's inventor, Mr. Hansen, believes Sophia will be ideal as a senior companion in nursing homes, a crowd control operator at huge events or parks, etc. That is to say, he believes Sophia will someday have the social abilities required to interact credibly with others. She also participated in an interview with actor Will Smith. You can go watch it on YouTube. It's not actually an interview, and it was more like a joke with the plot of both going on a date. You should definitely check it out. What more? Sophia has the ability to speak and is capable of initiating a discussion. She can display more than 50 different facial expressions and is skilled at facial detection and visual interpretation. She even made jokes about watching too much Hollywood fiction and reading too much about Elon Musk. You might have heard of a humanoid getting interviewed by a journalist. The robot was unveiled in Japan a year ago and identified as Chloe. The short video includes Chloe being interviewed in which she talked about her abilities. Further, it talks to the interview giving credit to the humans who have developed it. It speaks about passing the Turing test, which is a way to determine if a computer counts as intelligence. The claim that the robot was just unveiled in Japan as a futuristic development is untrue, yet you wouldn't believe how lifelike it looks. Detroit Become Human, an adventure game created by Quantum Quantic Dream and released in 2018 is the subject of the video. The makers of the game issued an interview that included the viral video to give people an overview of the major events that have occurred in the world and to lay the groundwork for the game's narrative. Yet still, the interview looks so real that you just have to watch it closely. The unreal closeness of Chloe's features to reality would creepingly catch you offshore. When the interviewer asked her what her dreams were, she replied that she wanted to be like humans, and for that she would like to have a soul. Creepy and surprising at the same time, isn't it? The AI industry has advanced so far that they can now even think on their own. We hope you enjoyed the video. If you liked it, then make sure to give it a like, share, and subscribe to the channel. It would be a great support for us. To watch more of our content, click on the links you see on the screen. We will be back again with more amazing content on the AI world. Until then, stay safe and stay updated.